It is the show that has changed superstars' lives. This is NXT. The future is here, and the future is now. Wonder what's on his mind. This is gonna be awesome. I'm sure the WWE Universe is dying to know what's going on. A lot of anger behind those words, guys. I don't trust that one bit. Not feeling the love for that superstar. Loud and proud. The belief is strong. Anybody actually believe that?
love between these superstars, that's for sure. Bad blood is a boiling. Bad blood is a boiling. Better not take anything for granted in this. Better not take anything for granted in this business. That's all I'm going to say. Bad blood is a boiling. Wow, what a reaction from the WWE Universe. I can't believe what we just saw. And if that's any indication, we're in for one epic night. Looking at this card, I just got to rub my hands together and smile. When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. In a match of epic proportions. Lately. I don't know where Adam Cole gets the nerve in thinking he can come in and take what he wants. Saxton, he doesn't just want to take everything. Adam Cole wants to rule the entire industry. Slam down hard. Beautiful technique. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Just attacking the back. Irish whip. Ooh, that kick could be a game changer. Definitely starting to lose it here.
Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. is going to be wheelbarrow Flapjack. face first <laughs> running hip attack what impact what a stop good grief the shoulders are down it's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down wow He's not looking like himself here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. It's decision time, Cole. Does he try to get back on the offensive himself, or does he attempt to make a tag here? This might be it! Oh, my! Is he done? No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch up. The two out of three falls matches saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a bro kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss sidewalk. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down, and the third fall was ruled a double counter. Oh, man! And now Rusev is showing them how they do it in Eastern Europe. Thunderous slam. What a stop! Good grief! Finish the job. Uh oh, Aiden English is in trouble now. Oh, hip attack. So sorry. He gets him with a reversal. Harsh impact. And that's the tag to Rusev. Look out. Oh, what impact! Oh, what impact! Takes him down in a major way, too. 
He's not going to like this. Ooh, what a maneuver. Can Rusev stay in? Nailed it. That was simply amazing. Penny and predicament. won the match. Whenever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners, Adam Cole and Kyle O'Reilly. The Undisputed Era. And that's a win to start off the night. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud. Hope you set your DVRs, folks, because that match is worth going back and watching again. When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. It'll be the Wyatt family in a match that will be etched in the record books. Big time matchup. Now look at this. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, and now we have a ball on our hands. Oh, yeah. They didn't need the match to start to make a point. team competition is that he doesn't need to take the entire brunt of the opposition's attack, though the thought of making a tag doesn't necessarily appear to be on his mind right now. This thing appears to be slipping away from him in a hurry, guys, and you can bet he envisioned things going... You can feel the electricity Ooh. running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. These guys are undoubtedly oh. going to give us a show here tonight. The Velveteen Dream already has an oh, iconic man. style, legion of fans, and multiple Match of the Year candidates. And the amazing thing is that the guy's only 23 years old. Now you can be sure that by the time the Velveteen Dream finishes performance, a heck of a lot of people are going to know his name.
destroyed. Oh. <laughs> He's on the defensive here, but it's going to take a lot more than that to stop him tonight. You see more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Oh my goodness, crushing it! I don't think he expected to be in this position here. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. I know it's early, but he has to do everything in his power not to let this get out of hand. And the shoulder's up in time. Look, unless you roll a tank onto his shoulders, it's going to be tough to keep Lars Sullivan down for three. Close line right in the back of the neck. Back handle finds its target. Whoa, Sullivan really dodged that one. He is rolling. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Jarring impact. Harsh impact. He's in a little bit of trouble now. He doesn't want to absorb much more punishment if he wants to win here. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. And set up a... Oh, nasty impact. One, two, Just before three. That was real close. Going to take more than that. You can bet every superstar on the roster is crowding around the monitors in the back to see which one of these guys comes out victorious. Oh boy, he is rolling. This is going to be big, one way or another. Sullivan sizing it in the headbutt. Oh, what impact. That should do it. He's always up for a challenge, and tonight is no different. Guys, at this point, I'd be shocked if his a look at this. One, and Sullivan easily getting the shoulder up. Gonna take more than that to keep Lars down. Beautiful technique. Wow, I thought he was a guard. Whoa, Sullivan really dodged that one. Oh, into your modeling career. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he reverses it. He gets it with a reversal. And there's the cover. That was nowhere near a three count. Too soon. statement here with this attack. Here's the cover. And he's able to get out. The dream remains alive with that kick out by Velveteen Dream. No, there's the reversal. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Turn the features 
clean off your face. Tremendous ring presence from the apron. Hooked up. Oh, what impact! A high-risk maneuver that works from that top turnbuckle. This is it. Look at this. This might be it. Oh, my. Warm up the cover. One. Two. True testament to grit. He's still in this. Could be it. That one fails to connect. Great idea by him. Too bad it was awfully executed, though. Specifically targeting the leg. Gaining some extra leverage here. Concerned for the rules. Two. He kicks out before three. Sullivan kicks out before three. What can possibly keep this giant down? A freight train, a Mack truck. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, look at Fireman's Carry! Only Fireman's Carry! Just when you thought he had nothing left. There's a pin now. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. And here's a last look at this one. Here is your winner, the Team Dream. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. There's nothing more pure than picking up a win in a good old fashioned one-on-one -on -one fight and give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire match. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to walk got the shoulders down. And Tom Ziggler quickly kicks out. Not yet. Also an amateur. He's going for the pin. And a kick out. Not even close on that one. Nice kick out there. 
And here's Ziggler showing some serious attitude. Ziggler may be in trouble here. To be expected, though, it's not like he's in there with the slouch, guys. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing to worry about. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. Oh, I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. Body on body. Wow. What is Baron Corbin's best strategy at this Jeez. point? He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. The amount of punishment he's absorbed in this match is absolutely trying. He got body on body there, but that's about it. You know a move like that could not keep Corbin down. No question, he's found a burst. Dolph Ziggler's in trouble. Look at Dolph Ziggler with the famous sir. The damage has been done. He's got the shoulders down. No, he kicks out at two. I don't think his opponent was expecting that. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Here is Dolph Ziggler in position now. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Hooked up. Back suplex. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. No way. Astounding power. Oh boy, he is rolling. Beautiful technique. Dolph well, Ziggler's not gonna like this. Dolph Ziggler may zigzag. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Dolph Ziggler gets the cover. Real close, too close for cover. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. What's gonna happen now? Dolph Ziggler is totally vulnerable at this point. Oof. What's he gonna do with it? Dolph Ziggler's in trouble. May have been a slow count. Yeah, and Baron Corbin may be running out of gas, but he's going to battle until he's way past empty. Dolph Ziggler's not gonna like this. Look out here. Dolph Ziggler's in trouble. This could be huge. Baron Corbin is giving the crowd a show, but he needs to make sure he understands what really matters. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Face Buster! Man, that was... his shoulders are down. One, and Ziggler quickly kicks out. Remarkable. Both of these superstars looking a little worse for wear right now. Eludes that one. Reverses that one. Oh, guys, there's the line. From the floor, back between the ropes. I'll tell you what, 
This is one they'll be talking about tomorrow at Worker School, that's for sure. Oh boy, he is rolling. What's Baron Corbin putting together? Ooh, what impact. Baron Corbin with authority. There's the pin. Oh, my lord. Left strike. Baron Corbin is measuring. The end of days. That's how you put an exclamation. Cover here. You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. No question, he's found a burst. This might be it! Oh, my! Look at that one. Super with the famous sir. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Harsh impact. Here is Dolph Ziggler in position now. Dolph Ziggler's going, there it is, the zigzag. This might be the, he's going to the pin, this could be it. Into the pin window. This singles contest has a victor. And here's a look back at some of the action from the previous match. And here's the last piece of the puzzle. Here is your winner, Dolph Ziggler. A big singles victory here tonight. You know, it didn't happen often, but I can attest, being pinned is humiliating. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire match. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive repertoires, lasting endurance, and an insatiable appetite to be number one. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. Drop kick! Oh, right in the back. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Nailed it. Oh, look, look, elbow, elbows off the chest. Samoa Joe looking a little startled right now. Oh. But not for a second do I expect him to back down now. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Done yet. Oh, that hurt to the chest. And there's the kick out by Samoa Joe. Yeah, it's going to take more than that to keep him down. And no luck against Joe there. Uh uh. Oh, nasty impact. Knocked off 
his feet. Now that's a takedown. He's making a statement here with this attack. Joe is in position. Samoa Joe with his back against the wall. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure of... Oh, what a cross face. Now he's got to capitalize. Bodies are not supposed to bend that way. tonight, guys. That killer instinct Samoa Joe has. We've got a cover. Barely at two and a half. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. Submission time! Doesn't appear to be locked in very well. He releases the hold. Wow. Part of me thought that was it, Cole. What a stop. Good grief. Here's Samoa Joe. Is he done? Nice job breaking out of that one. But there's plenty more work for him to do here. Drop kick. Beautiful. Uh -oh. Oh, oh my goodness, crushing it! He's looking at submission time! Looks like he's starting to lose it. He breaks it, I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm gonna say this, but I'm with you, Cole. So unbelievable that he broke out of it. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. So <laughs> leave him up permanently. Can he finish him off here? Hoping to end it here. Two, three. Yes, takes it. And here's another glance at these superstars in action. And so it goes. Here is your winner, Daniel Bryan. Guys, that was a big win for him right there. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire match. You know, guys, we learned a lot of things about Braun Strowman in 2018. But the most shocking, in my opinion, was his affinity for musical instruments. So I assume you're referring to Strowman's rivalry with Elias, Michael. A rivalry where we saw the first ever Symphony of Destruction match. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Elias getting put in check here. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed.
If I could turn back the clock to April 17, 2017, Byron, that was the night Braun Strowman did one of the most remarkable things I've ever seen when he delivered a ring-crushing superplex to the mighty Big Show. Uh, ring-crushing doesn't even begin to explain it, Michael. The ring literally imploded on impact. It was unlike anything that I've ever, ever seen before. You guys mentioned how the ring collapsed when Strowman superplexed Big Show, which was amazing. But for me, the most amazing part was that Strowman was actually able to get back to his feet just moments afterward. Yeah, the monster among men stood tall while the medical staff tended to Big Show and the referee, who laid motionless for several minutes following the impact. Dodges a bullet there. Raw 25 was a night where we saw many legends celebrate a quarter century of Monday Night Raw, and Elias had a pretty legendary night interacting with Chris Jericho, John Cena, and Jimmy Fallon. Michael mentioned Elias at Raw 25. He couldn't have been happy about making Chris Jericho's list, but John Cena really got in on his nerves when he interrupted Elias' musical disc of WWE legend. Look, Elias rightfully earned a spot on the list due to his ugly, hideous scarves, but Elias got to unleash some of that frustration when he clocked John Cena with his guitar, which I loved since it meant Elias couldn't play any more music that night. Cena then beat up Elias at WrestleMania, which I also enjoyed greatly. I'll never forget Elias' sad attempt to return after his defeat in a Loser Leaves NXT match against Cassius Ono. Just a few weeks later, we were introduced to the masked competitor, El Vagabundo. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Incoming. At this point, it looks like even the winner of this match will walk out of here beaten and battered. goes Elias. Elias setting it up. Ooh, what impact. To think, I almost wrote him off for... One, two, three. Yes! Unreal performance. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. Here is your winner... Let me guess, Cole, you're waiting for an encore. I am. When you get a one-on-one -on -one match like that, you hate to see one of them come up short. But that's just the harsh reality of it. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire match.